everybody. I'm getting up. It's um, early morning, day two, Sunday, and um, I'm gonna get Kobe up and we're gonna head out. Mr. Purple. Up early, we're gonna get some oatmeal and then we're gonna head out. Day two. Feeling, feeling lucky today? Oh, you're, you're talking based. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, day two, and uh, we're just hiking up this hill, and we're gonna get to the top and glass these two open fields and see if they're still out in the morning. If not, they're probably bedded down, and uh, we'll keep searching. <laughs> So we made it to the top, and uh, it's a beautiful view. I don't know if you can see all the mountains, but um, so we're just at this peak. We're just trying to stay a little low. The, the sun is right on us, so we're gonna duck down and just glass this area for the morning and see what happens. Um, there's multiple water sources around. A lot of clear cuts, new and old. And um, there was a lot of a lot of deer and elk scat hiking up this trail. But it was all really old. So we know they've been up here, but it was probably like a month ago or more. So um, we'll see. We'll keep you posted. <laughs> Awesome to uh, get some. So midday, Sunday, uh, it's pretty hot now. So I think all the animals are bedded down pretty good. We did a little more scouting, a couple of different areas. Uh, I think we decided we are gonna both, uh, I think we both decided we we're gonna go back up to the peak where we were glassing and saw the uh, four deer and the two bucks this morning. And um, I think we're gonna move camp closer over there and we're just gonna hang out and glass that whole area and hopefully we'll see some more deer and then we'll pursue from there so um, go where the animals are i guess that's a good yeah good plan all right we're all packed up colby's here oh, let me get that yeah. colby's here with me yeah mm -hmm. he charged the charge well, the walkies so we're ready to actually track and and be strategic and anyway, everything's packed up we just threw everything in here we're gonna go change camps right now we will show you when we get there and then uh, wish us luck. So we'll keep you posted. Hopefully you're enjoying the video. Alright 
folks a little update. So it is about six o'clock um, Sunday night, Sunday afternoon. And uh, we moved camps a little while ago. We came up to the top of the mountain and we're camped out a little bit over here. Um, but uh, I've been just sitting glass in this area. Um, there's a big, big opening hill all along here. Colby went to the other side of, the, of this mountain and he's glassing that side. And we got our radio, so we're just um, keeping each other posted. Anyway, um, the sun is still up pretty high, so just kind of chilling and waiting. And we'll see what happens uh, on this uh, afternoon night hunt. And um, hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll see some animals. And if not, we're gonna stay up here in glass it tomorrow morning and uh, see if those other deer. This is the same place we saw the the two bucks and the two does. And uh, there's a lot of sign elk and deer sign all around here when we came up. So. And definitely activity is just whether we can run into them so anyway having fun um it's awesome being up here in these mountains uh blue sky being out in god's creation uh, so anyway um man i tell you when you spend a few hours looking at bushes and stumps and trees, everything starts to look like deer. sun's already gone down and uh, Colby's still on the other side checking things out and if anybody's watching this um, man you gotta get out you gotta get out in these mountains and once you get out here there's just no denying that we have a creator So get out in the woods, spend some time in nature. All right, Colby just called me on the radio and uh, he's ready to come back around the mountain. So I'm gonna go pick him up real quick. This uh, little uh, fly got caught on my water bottle. Need a ride? Everyone's getting in. How was it? It was good. It was good. Yeah. 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 Awesome. Let's go get up to camp. Yeah. Okay, so it is almost nine o'clock. So the sun is going down now. Can't hunt anymore. So we're gonna get some water heating up here. We're gonna have dinner and then hit the sack. It's been a long day, tired, and we kind of game plan what we're gonna do in the morning. So um, day two is officially over and we will see you on day three. All right, good morning, everybody. Day three. Monday morning and we were up early the stars are still out it's an awesome morning it actually was was even cold last night um, so anyway Colby and I have a plan we're having a little uh, oatmeal for breakfast and then I'm gonna actually drive him down to the bottom of the, the, the hill here um, and then drop him off before it gets light and I'm gonna drive back up and be spotting 
um, and we got uh, radios to communicate. And we're hoping we will find those same group of deer. There's a watering, there's three watering holes, a bunch of feeding areas. Um, there's places to bed down. So this is the perfect habitat. And uh, we'll see what happens. So we'll keep you posted. Good morning. All right, dropping Colby off here at the bottom of the mountain and then uh, or the hill, whatever you want to call it. And then uh, I'm going to go up to that. All right, everybody. So I am up back up at the very top of the peak and I'm um, looking down at uh, the target area. I dropped Colby off at the bottom and uh, we're gonna just, uh, I'm gonna spot from here and just try to see if I can locate anything like we did yesterday. Uh, but this time he's gonna be at the bottom. I got a bunch of mosquitoes eating my face. Anyway, um, so we'll keep you guys posted and uh, not sure if this is the right strategy and I'm not sure if I should be filming when I'm supposed to be spotting right now, but uh, I can't help myself. Anyway, we're having fun. Sun hasn't even come out yet. You can see the sun is about to come out behind me there or to the side of me. Uh, looking for a great day. Uh, I love being out here. So anyway, Lord bless our day. explain our strategy. Colby is right about there, in, at the peak there, and um, we saw the deer all along here. There's a watering hole around the corner that way, and then you can see all around there's kind of dark shelter. So yesterday they came, out and walked, and were eating all through here, 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 it looked like they were going to bed down, but then they ended up moseying into these woods here. So, Colby's at the top. I'm spotting on all directions, and hopefully we'll catch them coming through, and Colby will be in a good position. We'll see. Okay, quick update. So, haven't seen anything yet. Colby's still down there. Uh, but we're about we're approaching about the same time yesterday that uh, they popped out. So we'll see. The sun is starting to hit <clears throat> the area, and um, that's when they kind of popped out. And then they walked around for a little while, and then they went back into the the trees, the deep trees, deep forest. So any we'll stay here for another. I don't know, hour or so, and uh, see if they come out, and we'll go from there. All right, so nothing, uh, nothing this morning in that spot. We were, it's almost, it's after 10 o'clock now, so we've been on that spot for four and a half hours. Um, trying to be patient, but I think uh, we're going to go scout out some other areas, and uh, I'm going to go pick up Colby. I'm driving down the mountain right now. And uh, we'll see what the day brings. So, still enjoying the time, even though we haven't been successful. Still enjoying uh, the na nature and just being outside. All right, so we're just uh, going down another area. Pretty good old growth stream going through it. Um, Looks like there was a lot of trails. Haven't seen any scat or any sign of any sort yet, but we're gonna keep going. All right, everybody, so a little recap of the Today's hunt so far, uh, we stayed on that area for a long time, glassed it. Um, I did a little circle around, tried to drive through, um, hike through and like drive the, the deer through if they were bedded down in this wooded area towards Colby. 
Uh, saw a lot of sign, a lot of footprints, uh, tracks and so forth, but nothing ever really happened. We went and scouted out a food area and watering hole near where we, where we were um, watching. Um, again, more, more sign, but just no animals. So anyway, it's uh, pretty hot. It's the uh, tip of the day right now. We, we took a little break and uh, we we're just picking some huckleberries to for later, but uh, I wanted to show you this bush. Check out this bush. There's like gajillions on here. Anyway, so let's see, cut the little huckleberries. Anyway, I'm gonna pick a bunch of these and throw them in the cooler, take them home for a gym to make some jam. Thank you.